हेलो फूड इज वेलकम टू फूड लैंड टूडे स्पेशल डिशेज आलू पफ्स जस्ट सिंपल सुपर इजी रेसिपी मेड विथ पोटैटो एंड ग्रीन पीस एंड ऑफ कोर्स दिस गॉर्जस पेस्ट्री शीट whether it's a game night or a party why just a simple tea time snack this is the perfect recipe this is called puff aloo pastry let's check out the ingredients how beautiful this looks nice layery flaky and super crispy puff aloo pastry putting in a dipping sauce all right so let's quickly check out the ingredients for veg puffs or aloo butter puffs here i have taken 1/4 cup of uh, frozen green peas which is mutter if you have fresh mutter you can you can take fresh mutter these are some dry spices i have taken 1 tablespoon of chaat masala half tablespoon of garam masala almost 1 tablespoon of salt 1 tablespoon of red chili powder and pinch of turmeric powder I have two boiled and grated potatoes here, half of a thinly sliced onion, one green chili roughly chopped, and this is the pastry sheet which you get it from the market. You uh, take puff pastry sheet. This is really uh, thick, so the puffs will be really nice and crispy. And we need some oil for. Uh, people who like eggs you can um use egg like get one egg and beat one egg for the egg wash but this time i'm just going to use oil to all right so i've taken the puff pastry sheet it's room temperature and um, i have divided into three rectangular pieces and as you can see i have folded in two halves so basically we are going to cut it here and that's the middle portion and each pastry will be of this size now just like that so basically i'm trying to get the equal pieces so let's cut this also make sure the pastry sheet is room temperature it just takes half an hour if you take it out from the freezer all right so equal portions and now we are going to get the filling ready and in the meantime get the oven temperature set to 430 degree fahrenheit all right so let's get the stuffing ready now i have added 1 tablespoon of oil here let's add green chili and onion green peas green peas and all the dry spices which is turmeric chaat masala red chili powder garam masala and salt and later i have added the boiled grated potatoes and this is the mixture i'm trying to cool this off for about 5 10 minutes and then we will stuff it in the pastry sheet all right so while my oven is preheating let's get the pastry sheets done let's stuff them so i have this and approximately 1 tablespoon of stuffing All 
all right so my stuffing is in the pastry sheet now dab a take a water in a bowl and just dab it on the sides you can take milk or maybe egg beaten egg if you want you simply fold it and stick all the sides just like that you can make any shapes you can make triangle or you can make this rectangular shape just whatever is easier for you just fold it and close all the open sides so that the stuffing won't come out my oven is preheating already so it's gonna be quick and easy snack any game night any weekend parties you can make it so quick and easy you can make these in advance and then bake it when you have guests coming over or your party at home or just for yourself with the tea all right, all right so my puffs are almost ready just to make it look nicer I'm just gonna get the fork and make this design this is not required but it looks nice and another thing is we are making sure that our all three edges are nicely closed all right so now get a baking tray place them three inches apart there we go and now we will brush some oil if you eat egg, you can beat the egg and do the egg wash. But uh, I'm trying to get this recipe purely vegetarian. So let's add some oil on the top just so it won't dry out. And we get that nice glaze. So they are going to be baked in the oven now and here you go they are in the oven for about 10 minutes or so until you see they are golden brown so my oven is preheated for 430 degree Fahrenheit so let's wait for this beautiful puffs getting ready And here you go guys look at this how beautiful this looks my gorgeous aloo puffs are ready and let me put it get the plate ready and let's serve this super hot super crispy and super delicious nice and easy to make Just look at this the crispiness and how the 
layers are popping out and the beautiful golden color amazing I can't wait to eat this I have served this with some pita chips some hot and sour tomato sauce and some dip that I had so look at this how beautiful so do try this recipe at home super easy super tasty recipe and if you have liked this recipe please hit the like button share with your friends and families and do not forget to subscribe thank you so much if you have already subscribed and i'll see you next time in another delicious recipe these are my aloo puffs enjoy this with some sauce or ketchup all right see you next time Take care. Bye-bye.